sorry. This is the first time I've. I, I should have maybe. Yeah. For a little bit. Now you you're, talk. You're really good with the selfie stick. It's pretty steady. For some '90s country, you know. Throw it back to a little. Uh, maybe maybe Tim McGraw everywhere, but whatever. What now? Oh, you know that song. Down Bob? in Georgia. What? Picking them peaches. Hunter yeah. Kelly, right here, buddy. Oh, really? that's yeah. it. Uh, Tim McGraw, man. I mean, hold remember the crowd. That, remember when I, he spoke to me first at ACMG? You probably don't, but I do. Uh, where were that. you? Were you in the tunnels, the battles? Yeah, I was. Of I was. I was just. I just told. No, this was the ACM before that. Oh, and that. Even game. before that, yeah, just chilling it. That's all I had out. And I was walking by, and I just told Carrie, my manager, I'm like, I'm talking to him, girl. I have to meet him. I mean, I sing yeah, his songs. 100%. I talk about him all the time. And sure enough, I walked out, and I was like, okay, I'm not talking to him because it was him and Faith, and it freaked me out. They're like icons. And then I know, and you, you go to walk by, and he turned and said, Hey, Cole big fan of your music and shook my hand and I literally I've never been that start I couldn't speak yeah it was a little embarrassing kept on walking I couldn't talk to him I just I said you don't even know and I just kept walking because what can you say in that moment I don't know there's I nothing mean, I, you can say I know I, it well was, you could have uh, thought about it I, I did I, I thought long and hard and that was one of those moments it's like you know Eric Church and Luke and Dirks and all these people, like they, they influenced me in college, you know, to oh, yeah. want to write, but this is childhood. I mean, this is like meeting one of your childhood artists. So that was, you know, getting to do that and for him to say he was a fan of my music before I even you know, got a chance, it was pretty cool. So later that night, what would you have said to him? If you'd been like smooth Cole Swindell to Tim McGraw, hey bro, I'd, hey, <laughs> hey bro um, to Tim McGraw. I would bring up the time I went and saw him in Albany, Georgia for the first time I ever saw him in concert and Indian Outlaw was his big hit and I remember he started it off about third song in the set and people went nuts like dun 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 and then he stopped it and said just kidding. Like, I'll never forget that and if, I wonder if my girl remembers doing like I don't know if he did that every show but I will never forget him doing that and like messing with the crowd. And I, now that I've heard stories and getting that it seems like the kind of person yeah. I need so I, uh, I, that was a pretty cool thing. I, 